somewhat less than promising. We're told to expect intermittent spells of heavy rain, which might very well impact on the quality of the football later. It'll certainly add a new dimension, especially for those players who like to keep hold of the ball. A few anxious faces, hoping it will all somehow stay away, but I have to tell you that, we are told, is an extremely unlikely scenario. And we have in front of us this gloriously imposing arena, absolutely picture-perfect for a game of this nature. As you can see, we've already started here. Forward it goes. Slitty. A really good feat from him. It into the and the shot! Slitty. In he goes again. for much more than that a difficult moment he simply had to deal with and it's been intercepted and that will come to nothing out to the right oh, nice touch and that's surely a foul free kick Just the talking to, I think. Yes, it is. Well, needless to say, he was expecting a better ball than that. Oh, he's, he's gone for it! In. There is the breakthrough. Oh, beautifully dispatched. There was no reaching that. Well, you know, sometimes it pays off not to think too much about things, just put your foot through it, and that was a good example. Great contact, and the keeper had very little chance. Deadlock broken. It, yeah, he's pulled him up for that challenge. Get the better of his opposite number. Last stitch defending, but that'll do. A long ball, but not especially accurate. It's Kasri. Slitty. Kasri! He has done it! They have pulled themselves right back into it. Tunisia are really pouncing on any straight passes in midfield. We're talking seconds from interception to the back of the net. It's counter-attacking heaven. Tunisia grab the equaliser and we're all square. Oh look Peter, there's a great ebb and flow to this clash and it's above all expectations for me.
and it's played forward. And there is the half-time whistle. Well, it has been an even contest, as the scoreline suggests, and it has been more than decent to watch. Reflections on the first half. That was a fantastic 45 minutes of football. I'm really hopeful of more of the same in the second half. Well, the scoreline indicates a pretty tight game, but there has been a lot of action in it, and it has been an exceptionally good watch. The score at half-time, 1-1. We're promptly into the second 45 minutes. Tunisia clearly have been the better side for me. Yeah, I know the score doesn't quite reflect it, but if they go about their game in the, in the same manner as the opening 45 minutes, things really should improve. And they've got it back as soon as they gave it away. Slitty goes looking. Kasri. It's Kasri! <laughs> Defending of the desperate variety. <laughs> Slitty. He's straight offside. Gets it upfield. Oh, no, that's not the ball he wanted. Slitty. Has he picked him out? He's got it, and he's got time! Tries to get it forward quickly. He's made sure that that won't get through. Now the ball's come loose, and the chase is on. Ball's gone out of play. Hoists it forward. Defence has got rid of that. Well, it did look promising to start with, but in the end they were thwarted before they could even make it into the final third. It's got through to him. Oh, he's caught in, in or out. And that really is the last thing they wanted to do. No second thought, a straight red card. Well, there may be some scope for debate over the seriousness of the offence, but none over its repercussions. We'll have to see out the rest of the game with ten men. Well, it was deliberate, it was cynical, and you have to understand the frustration of, of being denied a clear opportunity, but it had to be done. A time for a cool head, and that is precisely what he showed. It reached its target, but it was almost stopped from maybe good goalkeeping homework. Well, this is what we've been waiting for. It was definitely a brave call by the referee to give that penalty, and I think the way this game has gone, it could easily turn out to be the decisive moment. And here's Quality goal, lovely first touch, sumptuous second. So all square with almost no time remaining. Tries to get it forward quickly. And it's played forward. 
Now it's Kashri. Tries to locate someone up front. And there goes the final whistle. So you're tended in a draw.